What's up, guys? Welcome to it sucks. So, Avengers Endgame came out, and you're probably all gonna want to hear me say, Oh, I hate this, or maybe I liked it. But this film is kind of like Shazam, it's a perfect movie. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, this film I thought was gonna be okay, like it kind of how Infinity War was. And, but this film was pretty good. I actually liked this movie a lot. I mean, <laughs> the level that this film shocked me with. But basically what happens is, after Thanos had wiped up 40% of the Earth or something, he is now, they are now trying to regain with Captain Marvel, Thor, and Captain America, and Iron Man, and Black Widow, and Hulk. Like, whereas he goes by now, Ronan, on the other characters. And I'm not going to one spoiling thing. I might do what Jeremy Johns did. Shout out to his video. Go check that out. We had talked about a spoiler once. So, um, like I was saying, the it kind of reminds the comic books like Avengers Blood Ties The Reckoning, which was a comic too, which basically has the same end of the apocalyptic world kind of ways. And um it's pretty good how the Avengers did this. This was their first time doing it. Um But I'm wondering when they're gonna make the sequels to films like Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, um Black Panther 2 and stuff. And some other films from the from the MCU. Are they gonna actually like I would love to see some characters like Adam Warlock being Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 because yeah. And I would actually like to see Thor maybe make an appearance in that film. Or some one of them characters that give us a little reference to Thor now. Because we find that the universe is connected. It'll be fun to see how they are basically showing some cameos and stuff. But I don't think James Gunn would do it. He might make appearances. But not fully. But to me, this was a great movie. You should go see this film. And there's some great moments. There's some cool action scenes. Captain Marvel, they made her the best character in this film. And we get to go back to some events before this movie came out. So it gets you the time to go back to the um, first times where the original MCU films before Captain Marvel, Black Panther, Spider Man Homecoming, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. And of course, Guardians of the Galaxy came out. We had the original MCU. This one brought all those moments to us. There's some cool fight scenes and everything. So to me, this one will give you chills. And I actually like this one very much. I think that when making other sequels and stuff, that this is what it came to. And it was a pretty good film. I wonder what will happen next time because if they do make another Avengers films, I'm wondering how it's going to go. Because we got Avengers Endgame and Avengers. I wouldn't technically call this film Avengers Infinity War. Uh, I think the reason why they called it is because, well, the film basically is about everyone. And just like kind of like Endgame is, like Endgame. So, I really don't get why they call it Avengers if everyone's not Avengers. I think they could just call this film maybe Marvel's Endgame. I get how they want to make the house and catch with something. But would have been better for something not... Avengers or something, maybe something different. But did this film suck? No. And I hint you subscribe and hit the like button and watch more videos.